I know, man. You know, it's been a long day. I have uh, a million things to do. I've got to call the client. I'm going to call the client. I'll get it situated. But you know what? This isn't PA anymore. This is SME with uh, Norm's Kitchen. So I got to go. I got to show it to you later. What's up, guys? Norm, aka Thor Entertainment, with SME Productions. And today, what we're going to be doing is, is we're going to be doing some cooking over here. We've got some chicken. Uh, we got some sauteed mushrooms with carrot strips. We got some brown rice. And then we also have some steamed broccoli, right? So what we're doing is, is everything that we cook is five minutes or less. Not only is it five minutes or less, it's cheap. So this right here, Trader Joe's, you can get it for three dollars, three dollars and like fifty cents for three of them. So it's gonna be a dollar a bag of brown rice. This right here, two dollars and fifty cents. This right here, three dollars. You can get the uh, you can go ahead and get these organic tomatoes, they're pretty cheap, dollar, two dollars. And you can also get this for dollar, two dollars. And then the chicken, you can get a, a pack of chicken. Like eight, nine pieces for like 10 to 12 bucks. It's all cheap stuff. Five minutes or less, gets it ready, gets it done, good to go. So, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna come over here and get a bigger pot because we already started cooking everything. So, what we did was we sauteed the chicken, we cut up in small pieces, sauteed the chicken, and then we used black pepper, tonies, garlic salt, and then onion, and then a little bit of oil. Olive oil is better to use and this type of stuff, but it's up to you. We cut it up, put them in there. Saute the mushrooms, and what we want to do now is we want to go ahead and put the mushrooms and uh, and also the carrots with the chicken, so that you can kind of get that flavor going with it all together. Go ahead and put that pan aside, no problem there. Get that situated, and then we're gonna go ahead and put this here, bring this over here, and then we're gonna put the rice in there, right? So we're gonna throw the rice in there, put the pan over here real quick, and so now we got our brown rice getting all good to go and situated, and then we're gonna go ahead and take our. We're going to go ahead and take our chicken, we're going to go ahead and take our mushrooms and our carrots that we mixed together here in this dish, and we're going to go ahead and put it over here. So we're going to get it all mixed up together, right? And we're just going to go ahead and flip it and turn it and just mix it together, like so, no big deal, good to go. And then we're going to come over here, we're going to get our broccoli, and we're going to go ahead and throw our broccoli in there. What we did was we just got ahead and got a pan, we boiled the water, got a strainer, put it on top, and then put the lid. This is my own apparatus, you can obviously buy things for steaming vegetables specifically, but uh, this isn't a specific type situation. This is just like Norm's Kitchen, so we like to improvise and do things our own way so we can show other people that, hey, it don't cost that money. It's pretty cheap. So that's all pretty much good to go there. We're going to come back over here, and we have some tomatoes we already started chopping, and we're going to go ahead and chop a couple more tomatoes. You can go straight down the middle, nice and easy. Cut them in, cut them in half. Depending on the size, you can cut them in half. It's not really that big of a deal. Go ahead, boom, boom, boom. Cut those in half. Get that situated. Don't cut your finger. Uh, it will hurt, and uh, you will have to go to the hospital depending on if you chop it off or not. So uh, we'll go ahead and just get this situated. A couple more. We're good to go. Don't lose that tater over there. Keep that tomato right there. Ooh, the roll off. Go over here. Pour them inside. And what we're doing is we're going to be doing we're doing the chicken. We saute the chicken. We saute the mushrooms and put the carrots with the mushrooms. And then we did the uh, steaming of the broccoli. And then we did the cutting in the half of the tomatoes and then we put it together and you get a nice little mix of you know colors and flavor and the whole nine. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna step this up a little bit and I'm gonna put the goat cheese, aka go to cheese. I'm gonna go ahead and put this in there real quick and see uh, see how this tastes. And you can always do different variations, change things up, see what you think about it. You know what I mean? With the goat cheese you want to go ahead and sprinkle it on top and you want to go ahead and rotate, 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 and as you rotate you'll start seeing the cheese kind of disintegrating, kind of melting into the dish. Um, it's going to add more flavor to it, and it's going to kind of change it up because we really didn't season up the rice. You don't want to use too much seasoning because then you get then you get too much uh, sodium going. Sodium is not good for you, right? So uh, so we'll go ahead and uh, it's good for you, but not too much is good for you. Then you get bad cholesterol, clogged arteries, all kinds of bad stuff. And everything that I'm trying to do, I'm trying to preserve my life here. So we're going to go ahead and come over here, grab a uh, grab a bowl, bowl you find, grab a bowl, you take it in a bowl. Put it in the bowl like so, and then you got a nice meal just like that. Grab a fork. All I have to do is eat. Eat it, chill, easy, no big deal. But I'm pushing 17 hours, 16 hours worth of work, and then a client I got to meet up. Estenie's Norm's Kitchen with Estenie's uh, Production Norm's Kitchen. Uh, talk with you soon. Tune in. I'm gonna go ahead and get to eating. Peace.